The Honorable Minister of Justice. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I'm honored to rise in the House today to recognize a great community leader from my constituency. During one of my I Love to Read visits last month, I was greeted by the familiar face of Sue Homerson, a teacher librarian at Laidlaw School. I've had the pleasure of knowing Sue since becoming the MLA for Tuxedo in 2000. This year will serve as a milestone in our friendship as I learn she will be retiring this June. In her 28 years as an educator with the Pemina Tra Trail School Division, Sue's passion for literacy has greatly impacted both students and colleagues alike. She is the creator and keeper of an amazing library sanctuary where students are surrounded not only by an expansive collection of wonderful books, but also beautiful displays of their own artwork. It is truly a place that nurtures a love of reading and the appreciation of literature. Beyond the library, Sue was instrumental in creating the very successful Laidlaw School Makerspace that provides students with creative hands-on ways of demonstrating their learning. Activities in the space include problem solving, design projects, computer coding, 3D printing, robotics, and more. She has also extended her love of the community and learning into being involved with We Day, the Pemina Trails Human Rights Project, and the Canada 150 Project. Madam Speaker, I am so pleased to have Sue, as well as Laidlaw School Principal Ryan Scott, and Sue's colleague Leanne Pelser, as well as her sister with us today, as my guests in the gallery. Sue, I Love to Read Month won't be the same without you. I ask that all members of the House join me in thanking Sue for all of her heartfelt service and for being such a positive role model for her students and colleagues. I wish her all the best for a very happy and no doubt very productive retirement. Thank you, Madam Speaker.